Welcome back to Let's Play Undertale Blind. It's a good thing I realized it before. You know. It record, but it didn't record. Sometimes the inbuilt mouse is a bit finicky. Sometimes it right clicks to any left clicks. Sometimes the option. Sometimes it just doesn't click at all. And that's basically what happens. Now. I hit record, but it didn't record, so I hit it twice. There's no real reason for me to bring this up right here. <laughs> Aside from the fact I would be kind of annoyed if I record like 40 odd minutes and realize I didn't record because that has happened. And it sucks. Sooner a plane gets in the way, not on purpose or anything. Yeah, you know, for the longest time I had no idea how you pronounce Sooner A. Because I'd never heard it pronounced. <laughs> But you know, learning a bit of Japanese, you know, it kind of makes sense you now because not the meaning of it. I think the meaning of it is like uh, I mean, if you've ever you know seen any anime about it, of come across a character that fits the description where they're like you know outside they're all like you know but actually they really care, you know that kind of shit. But you know. Learned in the Japanese language a bit, where you know the uh, pronunciation of things. Would it, would it be called vowels or would it be something else? I mean, that's the thing with learning, another, trying to learn another language is I don't even have a great grasp of the English language. Like all this shit with you know all these terms and all that. It's just like I just speak, I just write. I don't understand it. I just do that. It's like I don't remember all this shit. It's like, I know, you know, adjectives and shit like that, but, you know, I don't remember all the lingo, man. But, you know, it's the soon, you know? So, soon there. It's like, you know, tsunami. The, the Japanese language only really has a few sounds, you know? You got your E's, your O's, your E's. E's, O, A, O, wait. E? O, U, A. Was there something else I can't remember? Off the top of my head. Doesn't matter. It gets in the way, not on purpose or anything. I mean, it's it's right there. Let's give the example. It's like it gets in the way, but I'm not doing this on purpose. You idiots. Seems mean, but does it secretly like you? No way, why would I like you? I'm a freaking flame with a hat on. Seems a bit excessive. Gives you a condescending barrel roll. <laughs> Can you imagine that? A plane doing a barrel roll, but in a condescending way. Like, oh, you're being condescending with that barrel roll now. <laughs> it's like freaking Star Fox is like, do a barrel roll! It's like, don't be so condescending while you do it, though! Man, I haven't played that game since I was a kid. You know, I don't know what version is the most uh, well-known. It's probably an N64 version. I don't know. I, I never really owned a Nintendo 64. I was, you know, PS1, PS2. I owned a Super Nintendo though, so I did play uh, the uh, Star Fox or whatever game on Super Nintendo. So that's the one I remember. You tell Cinder Plane it has a powerful rudder. Ah, you sicko! Yep, that sounds about right for Cinder. We go now. It smells like an airport parking gun. No, we can't. Hmm. We'll approach you then. Get close to Sundra Blade, but not too close. Yeah, human. <laughs> smells like an airport parking counter. I guess we made them feel embarrassed. Sixty gold. Is that gonna be? <laughs> I mean, we're 
We're in freaking Heartland. I don't know if we're gonna encounter the river first. But I wanna go back and, you know, trade in some gold to support the uh, dog's odd habits of buying random shit. This is a fry pan lying on the ground. Not the burnt pan. Is it a weapon by chance? Might be. And a weapon man. I think we're all consistent with some blind and fuels. Yeah, I don't really need that because I'm not going to be using it, so. Really awkward. So let's put that in the box. We there was nothing there. Before we advance in Heartland here, I really want to go back. Oh. Oh my god, I've had my call over the last few five minutes. Oh my god, I'm just gonna do that. I'm just gonna call. Well, are you gonna call or what? We don't actually have your number. I guess you're more a texting kind of person. Who is the wrong one? How can we fight on a conveyor belt? Fire rope bounds towards you. Fishless monster is never warm enough. It's cold in here. Do burn heartland. How can it be cold? Oh god. Friend, it'd be a candle. Heat up. You crank up the thermostat. Where's the this mystical thermostat? Fire up begins to get excited. Hot, 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 hotter! Oh, come on, really? We just gotta keep putting the heat up. Crank up the first that it's super hot. Fire up looks satisfied. Hot, 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 hotter, hotter! I like the effect of the screen actually changing to, you know fit with the uh, sweltering heat here. If we kept that up, we would have died. <laughs> God damn it, each time. Every time. Pick the wrong location. Still in there? Wasn't there a science guy in Earthbound? Pretty sure there was. Can't remember his name. We're going to... Perfect example of crap my memory is. Why are we going to Snowden again? <laughs> Dancing on a boat is danger but good exercise. There's no room to dance on that and you're not even moving. Then again, they could be moving underneath all that. We don't know. It wasn't animated. Any new dialogue? Did you play monsters and humans? You like to wonder, you must be young. I would play by someone else. I hate this stupid game. Monsters and whatever the hell he said is really lame. Yeah, it's the same dialogue.
I can't remember if the oh yeah, the dog shrine. But there's another reason I wanted to come back here. I can't remember where the snowman was. He was near the starting point, wasn't he? This is gonna be a long trip. Speaking of which, I might as well uh, see what Undyne has to say about these areas. This bridge looks dangerous, but it's very stable. In fact, it's just a rock for making that area. I think it looks more direct that way. Station of Greater Dog. He looks a bit like a certain dog I don't like. The Greater Dog doesn't collect that bit. He's only uh, left a maniac for affection. I still wonder about that cave. I always jump over the gap instead of solving the world. Sounds ever solves a dire. He always just um, marked his cross. I guess Undyne has nothing to say about this area. Slice developer's like, we didn't expect you to actually go all the way back to the entrance. Like, but the snowman, we're gonna tell him all these crazy adventures we've been on. Assuming he's in this area and I haven't, you know, already gone past him, because I can't remember. I guess there's no random encounters once you've cleared an area though, so that's makes things a little easier. And by easier I mean completely easy. <laughs> Thank you for taking care of me. Okay, you got nothing else to say. We've been on adventures, we've been to Heartland and you're still not melting, it's crazy. You must have like a portable freezer of some kind. I'm just picturing someone behind us just constantly following us with a violation. Now, well, maybe even someone with one of those, uh, key guitar things, you know, there's like a keyboard that you can actually hold like a guitar, which is weird. Whoa. Oh. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Did wrong? Easy now. I want to check out this area down here one more time. Our signal is getting me. Looks like the phone won't work, Master. So there's no reason to go for it. There's no reason to try to figure out what the hell this room is all about. Now, is it gonna be like we go for the final battle and then suddenly we exit through that door or something? It's like, and now you're back in Snowdy. Yeah, this this let's play is really inconsistent view wise. It seems to always be glitchy. It's like, you know, one day you'll be like, you know, 
of one or two views, and then the next thing you know, zero views. It's like, how does that make any sense? Like, not the previous part, the part before that. Currently, zero views, and it's the same for Persona 4. Not Persona 4, Persona 3 that I uploaded for a couple of days ago. It had a few views, and now it's got zero. It makes no sense. Meanwhile, Solid Downpour is in the double digits of these. It's weird. It makes no sense. Hey, punk, what's up? I chew a papyrus. How can you stand stones? I have no skin, so why don't we stand in gorillas instead? Because I hate grits. But you don't have a stomach. Oh, but I have standards. I am so glad you won on nine offerings. You two go together like Bastard and Betty. Time to fund the dog. Can't just donate it all at once. I wonder why, when you first approach this, it says something like, You feel like you're gonna waste a lot of time. Why can't we choose the amount we donate? Why is it always after the one gold at a time? Oh, it's just filled with coins. Perhaps if you leave and return, the donations will be used for something. Yes, yeah, something. It doesn't necessarily mean it's going to be anything useful. Also, how is that portrait down there supposed to be papyrus? I don't know, maybe if I zoom in on him, maybe it'll look more like him, but to me it just looks like some kind of panda or something. Oh yeah, I got 43 gold. Um, what was newly added? Oh, it's gold now. So the money was used to increase the size of the shrine. That wacky flavored and playable tube man thing. It's eyes, man. It's just creepy. Imagine waking up being surrounded by those. Yeah, it would be even more surreal if this music was playing at the same time. <laughs> like, oh my god, what the hell is going on? This is some kind of fever dream. Maybe this whole game was a fever dream. It's like, okay, so I had this really weird idea. I was like, freaking horribly ill at the time. And I was like, playing Earthman, and I was like, I could make a game. That has all these weird things that I'm envisioning in my fever from being ill. And I'm playing this game that's trippy as balls, but extra trippy because of that. Let's make that game. Perhaps if you leave and return, the conditions will be used for something. Oh god, it changed the music. Change it back! <laughs> the boombox is playing an upbeat song. It's having a psychological effect on his eyes, it? It's not clear what kind of effect that is. Ah, the next track is just the same but fast. <laughs> you will go insane! This is like some kind of demented Mario Kart track or something. What is that called? Is it marimba? Steel drums? Thinking that you know my keyboard has the steel drums, that's what it sounds like. I mean, you know, played on keyboard and all, but what would it look like like the real thing? Is it like a xylophone? Or is it actual drums? Because how could it make such a weird sound like that? Never thought of this. You know what it is? We, we've turned up the speed because we're on the final lap of I mean, we are kind of on the final lap of this game, you know? 
Oh, we got the Heartland, they did say. He's like, oh, yeah, the final area. Or something. Okay, now picture this, right? What if this music was played instead of the original music when this wacky flaming inflatable two dog thing multiplied and surrounded you when you woke up and I just now noticed the dog on the shrine is lying down while I'm sleeping. I guess the dog is gonna wake up and be like, what the fuck? <laughs> I can't tell if he's just like chilling out or asleep. Like, yeah, this is my lullaby. Um, what have we got now? Looks like a dog bought a CD for the Moonbox, but it's a game CD, so it won't work. I mean, would it? I'm just thinking back to the PS1. I remember there was a cool thing with the PS1 that's you put a game in upside down, you get the soundtrack to the game instead, if I recall. Honestly, when it said it's having a psychological, I thought it was going to say it's having a psychological breakdown. Next track is just the same, but faster. Let's go as fast as we can. More speed! Oh god. Yeah, it's having a psychological effect. Alright. How much faster can it go? Surely it's going to explode any moment. Oh Jesus Christ, it just keeps going. Up the tempo! Is this making the dog sleep? You have a strange uh, lullaby there. Oh man, can you imagine? This would be like, you know, uh, cruel and unusual punishments. Like solitary confinements. But you're, you know, tied to a chair. And you got headphones on and this track is played on a loop for hours. You'd go insane. Now, even if it was abnormal speed, you'd go insane. They could stop. Maybe it'll be used for an actual zine this time. Is this a fucking <laughs> picture of a virus? Think about a virus. It's a bit blurry, but it looks like he's angrily chasing the dog park. Was it the case for this one too? Okay, so he was having fun and then he was like, Hey! What are you taking my picture for? Come on, put it in the boom box anyway. It might work. Hmm. 
We are donating because, um, <laughs> you know, here's the logic, you know, it said that it's used as an incentive to make you donate, and that's basically what's happening. It's like, <laughs> we're donating in hopes to get a new CD so we can list to something different. Like, please buy a new CD and a CD that actually works. I wonder what game CD he now bought. And this picture and that's that uh, game disc over there is like some barbie games. <laughs> Jeez. Well, you know, because it's a dog, maybe it's... I don't know, I can't think of any dog game off the top of my head. There are games where you play as dogs. Yeah, I think the music resets the time, so you can make it go insanely fast and then undo it by leaving something. I spent all the money on a piece of rope. <laughs> However, it's really not very much rope for the amount spent. Seems like the dog got ripped off. Should I? Okay, I'm gonna go there with a the dark humor. It's like, that rope is just, I can't take this song anymore. End it, please. Yeah, that's some dark humor, but you know, if you were stuck in this room with this song on it, especially at fast speed, for hours on end, I think you would just go insane. How much have I got now? I have still got money. Not sure if I'll be able to donate for the next one. Man, if this all ends with the dog hanging themselves, that's gonna be pretty fucking dark. It's like, no, we need more rope. Oh gosh. If not for this music, I wouldn't have gone there with that dark humor. But it is quite obnoxious. Yeah, there's probably like an hour-long version of this song on YouTube, isn't there? <laughs> Maybe even a 24-hour version. And there are some people that are completely insane and dance like the uh, wacky flaming and tube man thing over there to this music. You know, honestly, this would make for good chase music in a, you know, horror game. You're getting chased by this freaking wacky flavoring two man as this music gets progressively more faster. Oh, you've added some, uh, dog statues here. It's even bigger now. Should be able to join even more at once. Actually, it looks like the size of the slot are just thin. Seem to still have to donate just one girl at a time. I guess because you can't fit any more in at a time, so you gotta do one at a time. Seriously, what are we doing? <laughs> This music will drive you mad. Oh my god. It's so painful, we have to do it one goal at a time. Oh, this music. This music. This is very repetitive. Not in a good way. You know, music, you know, it repeats, you know. But you know, yellow tracks aren't this chaotic.
No wonder why the, all the trophies are related to this, because you have to have a lot of patience. Like, should we have a trophy for, you know, getting certain endings? No. Just for getting to certain locations and donating a million times to the dog. Oh, my ear's bleeding! But, you know, at least this will be the last one we'll do for a while. Because we're out of money, almost. We won't be able to afford whatever's the next one. What the hell have you got now? It's a tap to dispense dog foods. So is there a tank full of dog food in the walls? Well, at least you got something practical going for once. Took you however many donations, but here we are. I'll donate two girls in advance. I'm getting the hell out of here. My mind. Are on my ears. I've been assaulted one too many times there. Well, let's go back to Hotlands. Don't snoop behind people's houses. You might be mistaken for a trash can. And people who dump their souls in you. Sleeping pattern has been crap. Nothing new there, though. So, who sets up a lab in a place like this? I rode on a conveyor belt once, I learned professor they make me sick. Do you hear me? It's like amazing. Awesome shit. And every time we pick the wrong freaking conveyor belt. Oh god. Now well, let's take care of the plane first. Oh god. Maybe I should have gone with uh I'll help healing magmas. Be sure you the plane turning tiny is like completely intentional. Oh yeah, I just noticed that. <laughs> if you're hurt, I'll help. By making you more hurt. How did I deal with you again? Uh, was it by encouraging you? It's doing a great job, man! Oh. You got a hundred gold, let's go. No, I ain't. Not right now. <laughs> I think. We've all had enough of that for one Um... Oh. 
And you guys work. Ah, oh, yes. We get to turn the heat up. Harder! Oh, shit. Oh, God. Crank that shit. Nick, whoever was calling and hung up before you answered. I should have stocked up on items. Steam vents, I think Alfie's told me about those. The core cools off by releasing steam from those. At the same time, it comes with those transports. Pretty cool if you aren't wearing a dress. Oh, uh, hi, so are uh, the blue lasers. Ah, uh, I mean, now he's here, hi. Uh, the blue lasers won't hurt if you don't move. Ah, uh, orange ones, um, uh, you have to be moving and they, uh, um, they won't, um, move through those ones. Ah, uh, bye. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> oh my god, I did it! What's happening? Shit. Look like that since Undyne called me to ask about the weapon. Wait, there's no weather down here. Why is she cold? What? Why did I call Alfie's about the weather? Who cares? Isn't it natural to love meteorology? Meteorology? Zoinks! Who by me and I thought that was just an excuse to block her? I didn't know there was weather down here. Yeah, there is! And I'm forecasting incredibly front of shut up! Well, we are when I need an umbrella. Wait a minute, we need an umbrella one time because it's raining, so there is weather down here, you lies. You're a liar, sir. Just in certain places, it's no uh, weather at all. That one's a bit faster. Oh, shit. Oh. This is bad. Switch. Where is the safe one or a shop? Oh my god, I forgot to tell you where I am or where to go. You pick me right now. It's a better of a garbage can and several pink glittery filters already. You sick and manly about it as heroes. I was always saying his soul is in trash. You just give us a picture of a trash can. Alfie's here, and the open door will stay locked until you uh, solve the puzzles on the right and left. I uh, I think you should go to the right first. One of these guys. A way to work is wrong, so I had time to catch a minute on the show on my foot. Special effects are amazing today. That human almost looked real. Better draw him, yeah, he's the most pumped star in the underground. This fan club probably has at least two, no, three dozen members. Probably about as many characters as there are in this game. I wonder if it would be unfunny if I explained the puzzle. You look like you mean serious business. The door leading through this area is closed, so I tried the puzzle, but I kept running out of ammo and it kept reached on me. And my two co-workers won't help. It's like they don't even want to go to work. Yeah, basically. Shoot the opposite ship. Move the boxes to complete your mission. Oh. Um. Let's 
strange. I don't get it. Oh. I see. I'm gonna get an move water blocks. Yay, I solved your puzzle. Wow, you solved it. I'm impressed. Why is everything I say a question? You must be a total nerd. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh no, the puzzle's reactivating. Oh, so feeble to miss that work. Well, Sans when he can Yep, that's why I'm missing work too. Oh my god, Sans, go do your jobs! No hints in there, not that we really need a bunch of hints. Oh, he's here. Uh, that blue laser seems totally a mess. But uh, as the royal scientist, I have some tricks up my sleeve. I'll hack into the Hotline Laser database to figure out. So what would happen if we didn't become friends? <laughs> it's like, I'm just gonna leave you to die. We were having that when suddenly a bunch of puzzles reactivated out of nowhere. Oh my god, it's terrifying. This is a huge problem. It rules. They've got to cancel school of this. Oh, it's a good thing then. Finally, someone turned off that laser. Now that we're free, we can... Well, uh, I guess we'll just keep standing here. We don't really have walking animations. You're the opposing ship. There's the bus. So, I guess it increases in the Congratulations! Ha! Those kids are skipping school! Well, I can't blame them, school sucks! We need to find some way to make it cooler. Hey, what if I visited that school? Then I could beat up all the teachers! I mean, does this world even have a school? Please have a shop. I've got no items. Whatever, I'll just explain it. Ah, uh, I think, um, hey, uh, about the puzzles on the left and right. Uh, they're a bit difficult to explain, but, uh, uh you already solved it? Awesome. Ominous. Uh, hey, it's kind of dark in there, isn't it? Uh, don't worry, I'll hack into the light system to brighten it up. Oh. Unexpected. Oh no! Oh yes! Welcome, beauties, to the Underground's premiere cooking show. 
Seriously, every time he says, oh yes, I just picture him sounding like Paul Bearer. Cooking with a killer robot, the newest hit sitcom. Preheat your ovens because we've got a very special recipe for you. And by the sitcom, I mean game show. I'm my game show. I mean cooking show, of course. We're we going to be eating a cake. My lovely sister here will gather the ingredients in the dark. Heaven give them a big hand. Give me healing items. We'll need sugar, milk, and eggs. Go for it, sweetheart. Sugar, milk, and eggs. Oh, we got eggs. I assume that is milk. And this is sugar. Great job! Just put them in the middle of the counter. Perfect! Great job! We've got all of the ingredients we need to make the cake. Milk, sugar, eggs. Oh my, wait a magnificent moment, how could I do this? We're missing the most important ingredients. Your blood. A human soul! Can I just run away? Hello, I'm kind of in the middle of something here. Well, wait a second. could you make a... Uh, couldn't you use a... Uh, couldn't you make a substitution in the recipe? Substitution, you mean using a different non-human ingredients? Why? Uh, what if someone's, um... Uh, vegan? Vegan? Well, I... Uh, it's a brilliant idea, I guess. Actually, I happen to have an option right here. MTT brand always convenient in soul flavor sauces. A can of which is just over on that counter. Conveniently place near the exit. Well, darling, why don't you go get it? I don't think of running away. Um. By the way, our show runs on a strict schedule. If you can't get the can in the next one minute, we'll just have to go back to the original plan. So, that's our time, beautiful. That doesn't sound fair. Oh no, there's not enough time to climb up. Uh, fortunately, I might have a plan. When I was upgrading your plan, I added a few features. You see that huge button that says, get back? Uh, watch this. It just looks like an Oculus. There! You, you should have just enough fuel to reach the top. How did you install something like that on a phone? Oh, get up there! Oh god. Gonna try to stop us every step of the way. Oh god. Ow. Ow. Ah. 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 My, my, it seems you busted me, but only because you had the help of the brilliant Dr. Alphys. Oh, I love to think of what would have happened if you, uh, to you without her. Well, toodles. What happened to the game show? Oh, yes, about the substitution. Haven't you ever seen a cooking show before? I already picked the cake ahead of time, so forget it. That suddenly became a lot smaller than it originally appeared. Wow, he, we, we did it. We, we really did it. Great job out there. Uh, well, uh, I didn't read the last bit. Anyway, let's uh, keep heading forwards. Now well, this looks pretty uh, ominous. An ominous structure looms in the distance. Filled with determination. <laughs> it's like... In this ominous place, would there by chance be a shop? Because I got no healing items. 
that's going to do for this part in this record session, and so see you next time, viewers. See you next time.